Hi, Davidson. Nope. Hi, Max. Popsicles. Ooh. More flavors. Three flavors. That popsicle. You can all listen. Yeah. 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 You're welcome. I wanted the creamsicle one, but I felt bad. I hear when you open a new box of popsicles, you you can make a wish. If you wish for popsicles, I mean... you're in really good shape. <laughs> oh, you could open it up. But I kind of just like stuck it in there before I even tested it. Do I have to get a guy to do that? I was just yeah. curious if there was a trick, mm-hmm. and it is working. It's just not very cool. At least not as cool as it was the last time. Right. Hmm. Um. I didn't know if maybe you guys had like a, a magic word or a special thing, or if you had to like expose a certain testicle to it. You have to take his clothes off. You have to force him to expose himself. It's normally a fight to keep his clothes on, so I shouldn't oh, have too much of a problem. I don't know what the heck. I, I, that's got to be the most amount of crit successes and fails we had in a game. Crazy. Smashy, smashy. You know the part where I tried to uh, do a strength grapple check on that thing? Like, the prison system is overloaded, so they've got prisoners in the back of the, the class and the citizens. <laughs> That's what I was Lens flare fade to white, star white back to black. <laughs> Lens flare back to video. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. <laughs> Got to get those star wipes in there. A couple of owl bears has steadily grown to a lot of them. A pack of wild owl bears with an alpha, the Shrike. Combat has reached a fevered pitch. And speaking of pitch, it is your turn. Who? 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 I'm going to use my rapier, and I'm going to do two stabs. Crit. Woo. And then I'm going to use disengage and dash away. It is very badly wounded. Blood dripping from the fresh wounds that you've just dropped on it. The owlbear that is engaged with horse girder and with Ibrahim is going to take a swipe at the horse girder. Beak at him, and he's going to claw at him. Girder all of a sudden transforms from his horse self back into the small Girder. Four moths that are riding on Girder's shoulders immediately <laughs> topple to the ground. Uh, <laughs> oh, that just sucks. Fall into a, da- a downy pile of dead owlbears. Oh, that's bad. Berdan, you find an owlbear? Yeah. He's going to take a shot at you, Berdan. The Shrike lets out a loud hoot, turns, and begins to disengage. Looks like he's lumbering back towards the cave. For Dan, it's your turn. Okay, beautiful. I'm going to attack this owlbear in front of me. You do a forward pushing motion to push your thrust further than you normally would, right up into the great eyes of the beast, and it slumps over dead on the ground. At the end of your turn, the Shrike is going to dive right back into God the hole that's up damn there. it. Let's get that fucking bird. Uh, I'll just use uh, Shocking Grasp. Nope. His head pivots around and looks you straight in the eyes. Flinch. Okay, Ibrahim, you're up. One living owlbear in this pile of otherwise non-living owlbears. (laughs) (laughs) I'm going to crawl under a dead owlbear. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, as you are tactically crawling under the corpse of one of the owlbears, uh, you take a moment to uh, place your hunter's mark on the final quarry left here. We're going after the beak right on the face of this one. (laughs) Okay. You swing and hit the beak. Make a beak smasher. Think about that next time you're deciding who you want to start pecking. (laughs) Hoss, you're up. Ki-i! Run and attack the last surviving owlbear. Oh, Jesus. We're just carrying on from last week. A trailing edge of your potato sack clothing gets caught on one of the owlbear corpse claws, <laughs> catches you off guard, and you go down and roll, and half of your potato sack is now torn wide open, and you're prone. It's a pretty strict punishment, a loss of a half a potato sack. <laughs> <laughs> Summoning his key, a flurry of blows at the... <laughs> Still going, yeah! <laughs> Fax mentis incendium gloria calpum memo bis punitor delicatum. All there, black and white, clear as crystal. You lose. What the heck? Uh, You land your blow on it and knock it down. It rolls towards you, and the weight of it crushes down on your leg. That's it for Haas. Girder, your turn. So I'll just go to the old shillelagh. I just want to knock its beak off its face. With a sickening crack, the beak opens, and the beast lies dead at your feet. Woo! Hey, do we want a baby owlbear? Yep. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
you put this baby owlbear in a headlock and kind of tackle it to the ground. It <laughs> slips out of your grasp. It's going to disengage and then head down into the cave. It slips away into the darkness. Bloody fine timing, companions. Thank you for your aid on the hunt. I sorely needed it. Hoss will begin skinning the pelts for the making of a set of clothes. And Girder's going to try to go for some organs. I want all of their eyeballs, maybe like a heart and a liver. Mm, I'm not too picky, but I don't want any organs. Did you see that one? I got a whole leg. Where am I going to carry this? Well, feast tonight, my friends. You are now head to toe in blood and viscera. Berdan, what are you up to? Are these like bodies and stuff? Make an investigation check for me. Is that intelligence? (laughs) <laughs> definitely definitely Guys, not I human point out that, that is the lowest roll we've ever had in the <laughs> <laughs> one. it's like you give yourself a migraine squinting at what it is <laughs> trying to put on the intelligence crown this is ridiculous moth what are you up to kind of checking out this cave trying to see if i can see down into it hoss is going to approach the party with a whole bunch of bloody pelts and feathers sticking to his <laughs> blood covered skin and he's gonna say what ho comrades are you intent on chasing that beast to extinction then we are following your passions hoss do you yes. desire a conclusion my passion is satisfied that was one of the finest battles with nature i have yet had i feel no need to bludgeon that noble beast to a further death moth will suggest that perhaps the knowledge of this creature's den and its uniqueness is of value alone i find it fascinating to study the fact that this one can fly even just for study I don't share your fascination with these beasts. Think of what they could do to the innocent folk around here. We should squash it while we know where it is. The baby owlbear is just meat for later that we don't have to refrigerate. <laughs> oh my God. It's like a can of owlbear soda. <laughs> <laughs> How would all of you feel if a great wild owlbear struck down a field full of farmers? Hey, let's proceed into this cave, guys. I could use a little bit of a rest. I'm feeling a little bit full of holes at the moment. I want to have a picnic. If someone would join me, I'll walk to the river and clean up. I'll help you, Abraham. Will you wash me, friend? Let's take a bio break. my password here fly guy boner 69 420 <laughs> <laughs> oh, finger of death oh yeah finger of death is awesome sounds like we cool. have the crew together we could turn you into a vase for an hour huh. <laughs> or that really pro strat of carrying a really big heavy rock around yes just don't forget to feed it because if it dies Jesus. Uh, that's the long and the short of it. The best of <laughs> taking a character you don't like and turning them into an instrument and then playing a song <laughs> they've got them. <laughs> Ibrahim, you were going down to the river? Who was going to the river? Haas would have gone with you, Moth, and his intention is to spread his newly acquired pelts and begin the tanning process. I will assist. Much obliged, String Bean. You must know much of clothes making and mending from your time in the wilds. Indeed. It was my primary trade before my waking life. Some quick ablutions. Try to get the blood off and sit quietly in meditation. For Dan, what are you up to? I am... Circlet of Intelligence is working. How does it feel? Does it feel really good? Satisfying. Ibrahim, what were you up to? 
I was at the river watching intently the washing of the hides. I have no survival skill whatsoever, but that looks <laughs> like the way that I would wash a hide if I were to do that. <laughs> if I wanted to. Yeah, I'm chilling at the cave mouth, sorting through this pile of bones here. A uh, pro flutters down from the tree canopy, hops along the ground nearby you. Oh, hello. He hops up on your shoulder. I'm going to pull out a juicy eyeball. We will enjoy this. It begins devouring it, popping into the eyeball. So the party gathers once again. Pitch voices his intent and says there's nothing in there for him. He's going to watch and keep guard from out here. The yawning mouth of the cave awaits you. I like balls. Before we step inside, I'm going to turn to Burdan and say, this seemed to work well, and I'm going to cast Daylight on his shield again. Okay, I'll take the lead. <laughs> You're going to go up front headlights? Yep. Haas close behind. I'll tuck in behind Haas. I'll bring up the rear and I'll cast my light cantrip on my hammer. And with that, you guys plunge ahead into the darkness of the Owlbear Cave. As you cool. push forward there, uh, um, We're Dan. Uh, you can <laughs> uh, you see about a six-foot ledge. I'm going to motion Haas to give me a boost. Haas will put his back against the wall and make a yeah. little platform. I'm going to scamper on up. I'm coming up behind him. Ready. Haas is happy to keep boosting. Get me up there, Haas. Take a boost, string bean. Alley oop. Haas is going to immediately 180 <laughs> and climb up himself. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think I can get up myself. <laughs> you slip and slide, and uh, Haas grabs the back of your armor and heaves on you. It does make quite a clatter as your chainmail mm. scrapes against the rocky floor as it's echoing through the cave in the distance. Hoo! 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 Uh oh. I'd like everybody to roll for initiative. Ibrahim, you're up first. What do you see, Brennan? Owlbear. <laughs> <laughs> Teamwork, yeah. everyone. Owlbear, you just push everybody out of your ways. You Owlbear, get out of the way. Let me find out what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I can just feel like your shadow in front of the shield. Yeah, you know? exactly. <laughs> <laughs> your slightly dimmer torchlight is now illuminating the owl bear that's in front of you. What else have you got? You grip your hammer and prepare, grinning for the battle to come. Is come beat me, bro. <laughs> beat me. Don't, don't beat me, bro. I'll skulk behind Burdan and Ibrahim, and then I'll wrap off a... Eldritch Blast. I'm envisioning you just like... Well, <laughs> how about this? One John Wu one. jump through the air. And the other is... One is the one, the other one's just your finger. finger. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> It's really not bad at all. It's brutal. That owlbear really didn't like that, so he's going to come crashing around the corner and take a paw at you. Beak you once. So you take a total of 15 piercing and 11 slashing damage. Ah! Beak me once, uh... shame on you. Beak me twice, well... You can't, can't get big beat again. That was so cool. That's 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 <laughs> remember that's what happened with that rock that uh, came. <laughs> uh, loud scraping sound as claws of another owlbear scratch at the earth as it hauls its hefty weight up. It moves in to attack you, Ibrahim. You're able to swing your war hammer as he comes up over the edge towards you. Ooh. You clock him the side of the skull as he's coming up, shakes his head and growls, continues lumbering up to get a little bit closer to you. And at the last second, Verdan's glowing, glimmering daylight shield comes and interposes between the two of you, claws raking against it, making a screeching noise, and the owl hoots in anger. Great work, Verdan. That's the power of light. <laughs> 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 Over that ledge, a cursory glance will reveal the injured Shrike, who has been licking his wounds, and the small baby owl bear, about seven feet below you. So that would make it Haas's turn. Haas is going to rush forward past Girder and perform a long jump off of Burdan with the intention of bypassing this owl bear to attack this owl bear. Oh, that's so cool. 
Okay, make a acrobatics check. Please pull this off. Uh, You leapfrog off of Bredan's shoulders. The owlbear sees this new threat and instinctively swipes out its claws at you. Bredan, you see him overcommitting and you push yourself forward a little bit. The owlbear falls backwards off the ledge, clearing the way for Haas, who lands with a thud. Not graceful at all, but like (laughs) bowling ball crashing through the middle. Haas will deftly roll, trying to look smooth (laughs) and purposeful. Summon his key and launch a flurry of blows on the owlbear assaulting moth. (laughs) A flurry of blows. We'll say that final hit was a huge kick to one of its legs with the intention of knocking it down. It clatters to the ground and is now a prone. Uh, That is it for Haas. I'm going to attack this owlbear then. You time your strike perfectly driving your spear between its ribs and the great beast expires. The old kill shot. The strike is going to flap its wings heavily and fly towards you, Berdan. Okay, so the little baby owlbear has to make a dexterity saving throw. It fails. Uh, so it's off. The, the, uh, like it, it takes off angrily trying to save the small baby owl bear, which is thrown 10 feet away from it uh, as it as the gusts of wind. Uh, Stupid baby. Uh, get away, baby. Completely smoked. And the shrike has landed amongst the rest of you. Gerd's going to run behind Ibrahim. He's going to cast a spider climb. Spider Ibrahim? <laughs> <laughs> Unnatural! Ibrahim, it's your turn. Ibrahim's going to go up the wall to get over top of the strike. <laughs> and then I'm going to scream and drop from the ceiling, hammer swing while falling through the air. The strike looks up and sees you. He denies you. and You tumble off his back and land on the ground. And that would now make it Moth's turn. Yeah, this is a tough one. Don't want to kill any of my teammates with spells. Fireball. Fireball. Fire. All right, I want to fuck, fuck your teammates. <laughs> and yourself. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Come on, Moth. Fuck this cave with your Come fire on, deck. <laughs> I'm going to fire off Chromatic Orb. Your scalp feels itchy for a second. Spilling out from your hood is all your hair. <laughs> so, like, all of my hair falls out? The bias. <laughs> yeah, I blew myself. The first owlbear sees a small target. He's going to rush towards Girder. Beak Ooh. and claws. Ouch. 35. The beast towers above you and roars. And with the shrike locked in mortal combat with the rest of you, we will bring this week's session to a close and look forward to next week. Hooray! Yay! GG, y'all. Thank you very much, James. Good night, Ty. Great game. Love you guys. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.